Here is the fifth weekly writing update to be posted on February the 28th, 2022. Thank you guys so much for the support on all of these so far. They've gone over really well, which I'm quite pleased with because I do think it is a good format in which I can just get across these short style updates. Speaking of which, PSA before this gets underway, the monthly forecast blog for March will be posted over on my website at aci100.com in about 24 hours. Little less than that, ideally. The link to that website can be found in any video description and any YouTube video I've ever done, as well as in the pinned comment of this video. So that should be easy to find for you guys either way. Where these are just quick little sound bits about what I wrote last week, how it went, what I plan to write this week. Those blogs outline everything I have up and coming this month. So this one talks about the podcast, which I've mentioned on and off, that I'm looking to start up. We have an official release date for the first episode now. That will be revealed in the blog as well as a whole bunch of details pertaining to that and a bunch of other things. So if you guys are a fan of my work and want to keep up with it all, I strongly encourage you to read that monthly forecast blog over on the website. Now, the actual update itself. Last week, I wanted to write two chapters of Conjoining of Paragons, a chapter of Ashes of Chaos, and a monthly forecast blog. Uh, yeah, I was a bit delusional. <laughs> I sense that you guys are by now learning that I tend to set unrealistic expectations in terms of writing output. I am getting better at not beating myself up too much when I don't reach those, especially when I have a week like this past one. I had a lot going on personally that really took away writing time, plus one of the scenes in Conjoining a Paragon's Chapter 29 took me eight drafts to finish. So that was a trip, but even in spite of all of that, I still managed to get the main things done that I needed to finish this week, that being two COP chapters and the monthly forecast blog. So all in all, I'm actually quite pleased with myself, especially because I can now give an official progress update for Conjoining of Paragons. I have not been able to do one of these yet. There are four more chapters remaining in COP's first year. So... The first major year, the first major story arc, that will wrap up in chapter 33. I have written chapter 29, and later this week I'm going to go through and do exact scene-by-scene outlines for the story's final four chapters of the first year. So that's exciting. I'm quite pleased with that. My goal is for patrons to have all of those chapters remaining in March. Worst case scenario... The latter one or two may come in early April, but I do expect them to be written and posted in March. Now this next week, I will be focusing on Perversion of Purity. If I can slide that Ashes of Chaos chapter in that I didn't get done last week, that would be fantastic. If I have time to write something but not quite enough time to write Ashes, I will try and slip in an FOF chapter. So... Two or three POP chapters because I really, really want to begin making progress on book three. Right now, I have that slated in as a summer release in terms of chapters beginning to upload again, but I do need to get moving. I'm at a good place in it. I'm not at all behind, but I do need to start making pretty steady progress now going forward, so I'm looking forward to that, and I hope you guys are as well. If you want to keep up with me, Once again, I encourage you to check out the monthly forecast blog posted tomorrow. I will be back next Monday for another one of these weekly writing updates. Until then, happy reading, enjoy your week, and thank you guys all so much for listening.